Hello! My name is Celica. If you're here today, you probably want to figure out how to get that nice full body tracking on your 3D model. So let's get right into it. First, you're going to need to download two things once you have your um, Vroid model. You're going to want to download VC Face and uh, another thing. It's called 3D Pose Tracker. Yeah. So I'm just going to show you quickly how to download those. So let's get right into that. Alright, so this is how you do 3D Pose Tracker. This is going to be a sort of add-on to uh, VC Face, which is going to do your like face tracking for your Vroid model. And this is just a little add-on for it. So this, we're just going to translate it to English so you can see easier. Uh, this is basically just saying, here's what it is. And the latest version can be downloaded from Booth for free. So if you just click on this link here, and then you're gonna, it's gonna load. I'll wait. I'll, I'll wait. All right, as you can see, Almost here, uh, it's just loading. <laughs> okay, so as you can see here, this is what the download page looks like. This is just a video of it being used, showing off how you could do all that sort of stuff. It tracks it, how cool. But you're gonna wanna click on this, the free download, and then it's going to give you a prompt to log in. Just make a free account if you don't have a booth account already. And then after that, you could just download it and it'll go right on your computer. Alright, so the other thing you're going to need to download is VC Face. So this is going to be the main thing that runs your face tracking and eventually, I guess, your body tracking for this. So just scroll down, hit download. This one is more straightforward. Alright, you have your two softwares downloaded and now you just need to get them connected so VC Face can read the input from the 3D Pose Tracker. So this uses something called VMC protocol, which I don't really know what it is specifically. I just know it sort of connects the two. And so it uses an IP address and a port. So basically in order to make sure you have this going, you're just gonna wanna look for the section in the configuration page of 3D Pose Tracker that says, send VMC protocol. You're gonna wanna have that box checked. And then it's going to say IP and port. And basically all you're gonna get all you're going to want to do is go over to your um, VC face, go into your general settings. Once again, check the box that says send VMC protocol and make sure the IP and the port is the same. And then you'll know you hook them up correctly once you see uh, your, your model sort of T-posing. <laughs> if you don't have any input coming from 3D, uh, the 3D tracker. And basically, so how this works is the 3D pose tracker takes in all the input and then VC face just kind of shows it, I think. That's what it at least looks like from the user end. But also, here is how to use the actual tracking on 3D pose thing. So there are, I guess, like two main ways that I see being used the most on how to use it. There is one where you could just like upload a movie and it'll read like uh, the pose data and it'll just try and like configure itself so there. So if you have like a dance video, you can go and put it in and it'll make your model do the little dance. You can also have your thing read it in real time so you can use a camera. And in all, uh, in all actuality, I just use my grainy laptop camera and it worked out just fine. Okay, so lastly, here are just some tips on how do you get the best recording that I have found because you don't want your uh, model looking like this. Scary, huh? Um, but yeah, so make sure your full body is in view and 
this is pretty important because it's gonna be just looking for your different body parts and if it doesn't see like a foot it's not gonna know where that foot is so that foot's just gonna go crazy on your model trust me i've been playing around with this thing it creates some very very interesting poses um and just make sure you're in a very well lit area make sure there is a good contrast between you and your background and yeah i'd say that's about it this is super easy to download it's super good um and it is free all you literally need is a computer and a webcam <laughs> um yes thank you so much for checking this out and i will see you uh whenever that is and also kda more cover coming soon i swear i'm almost done recording and mixing it i just have the bridge to record uh and some random alibs and harmonies painful but excitement. Alright, that's enough of me rambling. Bye!